Hello. How are you guys? I haven't talked to you in so long. In all seriousness, hi, I haven't posted really anything constructive in a while, so I figured I would. I'm just letting you guys know what I've been up to lately. I've been recording a new song. Um, I'm doing a cover of Remember When It Rained by Josh Groban. Um, one of my favorite songs in the universe. Josh Groban's amazing. I kind of used a little bit of inspiration from Enya in making this, so... That'll be an interesting touch. What I'd really like to talk about in this video is Lady Gaga. Lady Gaga released her new single called Born This Way from her um, upcoming album, which is also called Born This Way. Um, she performed it on the Grammys, and it has gotten a lot of positive reception. Um, however, there have been a lot of people saying that it is a copy of Madonna's song um, Express Yourself that was released way back in 1989. First of all, I'd like to say these people are entitled to their opinion. I w listen to Express Yourself and then listen to Born This Way, and there are a lot of similarities. Um, there's a lot of beat similarities, a lot. there's a few melody similarities, however, the song is themed differently, and it's about something completely different than what Madonna was portraying in Express Yourself. Lady Gaga in the past has claimed that Madonna is a major source of inspiration for her, which honestly is a good thing. Madonna should be honored that this rising star is promoting her promoting her by saying that she is inspired by her. I mean, each and every artist out there has an inspiration. Um, or is inspired by somebody. And I just think people need to stop criticizing so much because Lady Gaga is not copying Madonna. Lady Gaga is paying homage to Madonna. In, me in the music industry, you don't have to literally go out and say, Oh, I'm paying homage to this singer, blah, blah, blah. Now, if Lady Gaga completely copied the song, like, exactly replicated it, then I would probably say, yes, she is plagiarizing somebody else's music. But the music industry and the literary industry function a lot differently. I mean, it's a lot more difficult copying everything of a given artist in the music industry than it is in the literary industry. Um, there's a lot, like, yes, Lady Gaga does use Madonna as inspiration, but she puts her own twist on it. I will honestly admit there was a point in time where I hated Lady Gaga a lot. I hated her because she was a rising star, she got so much acclaim, but when I started listening to her music, it does have a lot of meaning to it, and she does work really hard for what she does. I mean, how many singers do you see, or how many singers are there out there who can sing live and dance at the same time and still be able to pull it off very theatrically? Um, I have yet to find other um, one other than Madonna, Lady Gaga, and a couple others. Um, I'm just saying, before you start hating something, get to know it first. You might be surprised at what you find.